They're racing on now just outside the two mark and Royal Diplomat Pat Smullen on the far side. My Silver Nails, the grey in the centre. Gary Carlin on the near side. Moonlight Bay making ground. Legat and Verheyen and Verbitude putting in a late bid down the outside. Racing now uphill towards the final 200 yards and Royal Diplomat on the inside being pressed by Moonlight Bay and in between them is My Silver Nails running up towards the finish now and Moonlight Bay and Chris Hayes are going to win the opening race for Kevin Prendergast and Norman Ormiston. Royal Diplomat second, Verheyen third. They're followed in by My Silver Nails, Verbitude and way back home. They're racing on now just outside the two mark and Royal Diplomat Pat Smullen on the far side. My Silver Nails, the grey in the centre. Gary Carlin on the near side. Moonlight Bay making ground. Legat and Verheyen and Verbitude putting in a late bid down the outside. Racing now uphill towards the final 200 yards and Royal Diplomat on the inside being pressed by Moonlight Bay and in between them is My Silver Nails running up towards the finish now and Moonlight Bay and Chris Hayes are going to win the opening race for Kevin Prendergast and Norman Ormiston. Royal Diplomat second, Verheyen third. They're followed in by My Silver Nails, Verbitude, and Way Back Home. And then comes Virtues, but Alphabet is out a couple of lengths in front now, has stretched four clear. Mafahila is second, then Invincible Riker and Jet Streaming in 66, but Alphabet out in front, racing up towards the final 200 yards now, and out clear, Alphabet and Anna O'Brien coming home a six-length winner. Very impressive. Alphabet Anna O'Brien opens the season for her father, Aiden, in great style. Mafahila, Jet Streaming, Invincible Riker, and they're followed in by six and then comes Tassona. Mafi Hila, and then comes Virtues, but Alphabet is out a couple of lengths in front now, has stretched four clear. Mafi Hila is second, then Invincible Riker and Jet Streaming in 66, but Alphabet out in front, racing up towards the final 200 yards now, and out clear, Alphabet and Anna O'Brien coming home a six-length winner. Very impressive. Alphabet Anna O'Brien opens the season for her father, Aiden, in great style. Mafi Hila, Jet Streaming, Invincible Riker, they're followed in by 66 and then comes Tassona. Down the outside, Baron's Lad beginning a strong run with 60 Sioux also prominent, beginning the climb now towards the final furlong. Dark Defender with Baron's Lad on the near side, 60 Sioux, and they're coming through. Ducky Mal and Bubbly Bellini with a late effort as they race up. Jim Kana putting in a strong run in the centre and comes through to just hit the front. Jim Kana and Colin Keane now stretching on a couple of lengths in front, being followed by Ohosan Van, who'll probably get the second. Marek Bubbly Bellini and they're followed in by Imagine If, who finishes fifth. Down the outside, Baron's Lad beginning a strong run with 60 Sioux also prominent, beginning the climb now towards the final furlong. Dark Defender with Baron's Lad on the near side, 60 Sioux, and they're coming through. Ducky Mal and Bubbly Bellini with a late effort as they race up. Jim Kana putting in a strong run in the centre and comes through to just hit the front. Jim Kana and Colin Keane now stretching on a couple of lengths in front, being followed by Ohosan Van, who'll probably get the second. Marek Bubbly Bellini and they're followed in by Imagine If, who finishes fifth. As they begin now to race on towards the final furling and a half, and Hailstone, Zelena, Gino Severini, and they're followed by Circus Ring. Just in behind them comes Mr. Adjudicator, racing on now towards the final furlough, and Gino Severini towards the near side, Chris Hayes just in front. Hailstone, Zelena in between horses, Mr. Adjudicator and Hansi and Prince running on, but racing up towards the finish. Gino Severini is going to win it. It's going to be a double for Chris Hayes on the day. Second home, Hailstone, Zelena, Mr. Adjudicator. As they begin now to race on towards the final furlong and a half, and Hailstone, Zelena, Gino Severini, and they're followed by Circus Ring. Just in behind them comes Mr. Adjudicator, racing on now towards the final furlong, and Gino Severini towards the near side, Chris Hayes just in front. Hailstone, Zelena in between horses, Mr. Adjudicator, and Hansi and Prince running on. But racing up towards the finish, Gino Savarini is going to win it. It's going to be a double for Chris Hayes on the day. Second home, Hailstone, Zelena, Mr. Adjudicator, Hansi and Prince towards the inside, and they're clear of elusive beauty.
somehow making ground between horses and then comes Chili Spice as they begin now to make the run towards the final furlong and a half and in the center Zaba with somehow Queen Anne's legs flying fairies on the outside racing now on the climb towards the final furlong somehow in the center Zabo on the stand side as they begin the climb up towards the finish flying fairies on the near side as they race inside the last hundred yards now and it is Zabo Zabo and Graham Lee had his first ride here 25 years ago today and Zabo wins for Mick Shannon somehow his second flying fairies Queen Anne's lace followed in by Wild as the Wind the outside is Juline, somehow making ground between horses, and then comes Chili Spice as they begin now to make the run towards the final furlong and a half. And in the center, Zaba with somehow Queen Anne's legs flying fairies on the outside, racing now on the climb towards the final furlong. Somehow in the center, Zabo on the stand side as they begin the climb up towards the finish, flying fairies on the near side as they race inside the last hundred yards now. And it is Zabo, Zabo and Graham Lee had his first ride here 25 years ago today and Zabo wins for Mick Shannon somehow his second flying fairies Queen Anne's lace followed in by Wild as the Wind Against the rail is Tribal Path, who's showing just ahead of Spring Offensive in the centre. Lean and Keen just headed on the outside by Aussie Valentine. One Night I Dreamed and Silkander are bad. Sea Wolf making ground in the centre of the track now to race up to Aussie Valentine. Spread across the track as they begin the run now towards the final furlong. With on the far side coming through now Brendan Bracken. With on the near side Aussie Valentine and Sea Wolf and Spring Offensive. But it is Brendan. Bracken and Gary Carroll is going to score for Jer Lyons in second of the afternoon. Aussie Valentine is second and third place comes Seawolf. One night I dreamed and Silkander are bad. Seawolf making ground in the center of the track now to race up to Aussie Valentine. Spread across the track as they begin the run now towards the final furlong. With on the far side coming through now Brendan Bracken. With on the near side Aussie Valentine and Seawolf and Spring Offensive. But it is Brendan Bracken and Gary Carl is going to score for Jer Lyons is second of the afternoon. Aussie Valentine is second and the third place comes Seawolf and they're followed in on the inside by Tribal Path and Mr. Wright and Brooke Aponte. As they begin now to race on to the final two, an order of the garter and Anna O'Brien again way out in front, beginning the run to the final furlong. Not too many have counted in this race. Tommy Hallen in his second, Tour Sun moves into third, pocket full of dreams, gold spinner, Inca Gold in the middle of the track. But it's a one horse race again, an earlier victory for Alphabet for Anna O'Brien, and this is another very comfortable one as Order of the Garter storms home clear by ten lengths. It's a double for Aiden and Daughter. Anna, second home, Tommy Helen and Port Moody has come through for the third. Pocket full of dreams, gold spinner, followed in by Tour Sun. Tour Sun is next. As they begin now to race on to the final two, an order of the garter and Anna O'Brien again way out in front, beginning the run to the final furlong. Not too many have counted in this race. Tommy Helen in his second. Tour Sun moves into third. Pocket full of dreams, gold spinner, Inca Gold in the middle of the track. But it's a one horse race again. An earlier victory for Alphabet for Anna O'Brien, and this is another very comfortable one as Order of the Garter storms home clear by 10 lengths. It's a double for Aiden and daughter. Anna, second home, Tommy Helen and Port Moody has come through for the third. Pocket full of dreams, gold spinner followed in by Tour Sun.